WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We're the Dow and Dow. Off uh, 238, S&P's down 79. That's a, a downdraft, folks, of 2% uh, in the S&P, 2.1% in the and the, and the NASDAQ and, and 1.5 in the Dow. Gold. Gold contract down $28.80, trading at 1780 an ounce. We have silver down $0.85, cents, $22.40 an ounce. Late sweet crude down $2.69, $77.28 a barrel. Notes and bonds. You get the 10-year note trading down 25 ticks at 113.28. The 30-year off 30 at 128.27. And King Dollar. King Dollar's rejected lower price. You're up 737 to 105, 282. Euro 104, yen at 136, and the British pound at 121 to 1 US dollar. We can open and take a look at the SPY, folks. Uh, bottom line, yeah, SPY, we still have divergence out here. The NDX is telling us what this market wants to do. So you're pulling back with light volume. That's what we did on Friday, but guess what? You're inside that range on the SPY. Now, as soon as you hit the 402, that's saying the game is down to this uh, 390. And right now, you're at uh, 399. We look at the NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX. What do you have inside the NDX? Now, the NDX came inside the lower range on Friday. Bottom line, once we got back inside this uh, 293, that put game on down to the 279. Now, it's going to get intriguing here. Let me put this line up so you can see this. Because when we get to 290, uh, 284, 284. If you get inside 284, that's, that's, that says that gap's going to be wide open. Now, we're pulling back on light volume. So what I'd be doing out there is uh, getting a list of stocks that you want to buy. Because light volume, folks, on a pullback like this would make sense. We had the expansion up, you know, bottom line. It says you pull back into strength. You do it with light volume. That's a buy. We go into the gold contract. Gold contract gave it up. We got to 1822. Gave it up. We're at 1770. This is uh, actually... Uh, telling us that this thing wants to move down because it's a lost engulfing, man. You know, you, you get up, you cover the whole thing, so that's saying gold can run back down to that 1733 again, and then if we get over to the dollar, it's all about the dollar. The, you know, the, the dollar's been trying to make a bounce. It hasn't been able to do it yet. You know, we'll see whether they can do it. The dollar was have to still get back inside the 106, 281, you know, but the bottom line is that we came into that swing today. The swing we came into was 104, 636. Went to 104, 113, and bottom line rejected it. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.